Hey guys, you're probably thinking, wow, she looks kind of like a crack whore right now. Just because I'm wearing makeup from last night, but today I just wanted to vlog for you guys. Do like a daily vlog and just be super raw and real. This is honestly like what I look like when I wake up. I literally just got out of bed and put on these random clothes. And yeah, my bed's still really messy and not made. Um, my room's kind of messy just in general. Um, it's not terrible, but it's, I have a few things I need to like clean up as I go. But yeah, I'm gonna make breakfast. I'm gonna just walk you guys through my day. I have no plans, so it's just gonna be real raw and authentic. I might go to the gym later. We'll see what happens. And I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who's been donating on my GoFundMe. We've reached over 75% in around 24 hours, which is crazy. And I could never have imagined the amount of tangible support like in such a tangible way happening so quickly like that blows my mind thank you guys so much and thank you to everyone who just in general supported me and has been supporting me and left nice comments and yeah i don't know i'm just floored thank you so much this is crazy <laughs> Here it is, my bagel BLT open-faced with smoky tempeh bacon, some cheddar daya cheese, some veganese, some garlic powder, some grape tomatoes, spinach, and sauteed mushrooms. What do you guys think? Looks pretty good, right? Still looking ratchet, but I just wanted to show you guys my little brunch nook. That not so cute. So I'm just gonna watch some Grammys highlights on TV and have my brunch. Okay, I'm just gonna go hop in the shower and then I will see you guys on the other side and I'm ready to be a little bit productive. I'm gonna edit a video and do some stuff. So let's get this started. <coughs> Just got out of the shower. This is my outfit of the day. Just my classic cut knee jeans with a belt and a cropped hoodie and some nice warm cozy socks. And as you guys can see, I made my bed and pretty much cleaned my room. I just have like some stuff over here and my desk, which needs some work. But yeah, overall, just getting stuff done. So I just got back from City Market, picked up my favorite almond silk creamer hazelnut for coffee honestly this is the best coffee mix i've had vegan wise and i'm just brewing some coffee and then i will hopefully have the energy to edit a video or something featuring my crazy hair emma's just over here on the couch Eating chips. i don't know if i can zoom oh i can pringle life pringle life <laughs> It's like single life, but Pringle hey, life. This is just like your other video where you're like, oh, whenever I think of you, I think of chips. Or like, always, always, <laughs> here you are. I hear you chewing chips all the time. Honestly, but the I proof swear, is in the pudding. I never chips yes, until, you do. Like, I don't care. <laughs> she does. 
So here's a snapshot of what I'm making for dinner. I have some linguine boiling, some cashews, and I'm gonna put some Ikea veggie meatballs into the oven. And I'm gonna basically make like a rose linguine and meatball kind of dish. And I'm going to save some for my meal prep for work tomorrow and potentially Thursday. So yeah, and I will keep you guys updated as I go through the cooking routine of this. Okay, so terrible lighting, I know, but I have my coconut cream here and I'm going to make my cashew sauce. I have some nutritional yeast and garlic powder and cashews that are boiled, obviously. I'm gonna add in some coconut. And then I'm also just gonna add in a basic Classico tomato basil sauce just to make it more of like a rosé. Does this not look so weird, you guys? It's like literally a layered pre-mix for the sauce. So, cashews on the bottom, nutritional yeast, salt and pepper, garlic powder, two full cloves of garlic, a bunch of coconut cream, and some tomato basil on top. Gonna mix it all up together and have a rosé, hopefully. I'm just making this up as I go. So I'm just frying up some delicious looking mushrooms. They're cremini and some pepper. And then I'm gonna add on some spinach. And this is gonna be my veggie base for my dish, um, just to go along with the sauce and the veggie ball so it's not too plain, you know? So I always like frying up some veggies on the side. Over here I just have my noodles uh, keeping warm in this pot with the rosé sauce on it. And let me tell you, they look delicious. And the sauce actually turned out amazing. So here's the finished result, you guys. It is a rosé linguine with sautéed mushrooms, spinach, orange pepper, and on top I just crumbled some parmesan from Earth Island. It's fully vegan and some Ikea veggie balls with a little bit of sriracha because I love a little bit of spice and everything I have. And yeah, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? This is just a little sample of what meal prep looks like for me. So I put my extra pasta into this dish, which I got from Amazon, not sponsored, but it was around like 30 bucks for three of them. A little bit pricey, but the reason why I picked them is because they actually have a sealed barrier. So I can have a salad and a main in the same dish, which is what I really wanted. Yeah, I don't know. I think they're good portion sizes. Putting a little bit of extra Parmesan on top. And also I'm gonna squeeze some lemon on top as well. And then the other compartment, I normally will make my salad the day of just so it's a little bit more fresh. I look so weird today. I don't know what it is. But anyways, I just got back from the gym with Emma. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> another leg day pour moi. And I might have a cliff bar. I've been eating them lately just for extra calories. Um, and they're really good. I don't know if I'll have this. I might, I might have like other snacks too. I bought some Pringles today, so. <laughs> I just like having more snacks now that I'm working out because I feel like I can and I'm always someone who's been very skinny my whole life so I really feel like I'm starting to bulk up more because I'm eating more in general and it doesn't always have to be super healthy because most of the time I eat healthy so it's good to indulge once in a while. <laughs> 